Now I am showing you the lying leg rest. This exercise is not recommended for people who have uh, lower back pain because it put a lot of pressure on your lower back. But if you just a beginner or heavy weight, you can manage this by uh, doing this modification. Bend your knee to your chest uh, and do it halfway like so. You don't have to put your leg down to the floor. It's too heavy. So you just keep it uh, halfway to your chest, come out halfway, tuck it back. Another one to uh, modify them is to do one rep at a time. So put your feet down, raise them up to your chest, bend your knee, and then come out like so. Just make sure you engage your core the whole time to protect your lower back from uh, getting too much pressure. So try this out. Last example for this one, you can do one leg at a time. This one is quite safe for your lower back, so no pressure on your lower back at all. It's quite easy. You just have to engage your abdominal muscle and also your quad muscle, the front of your leg. Now the sit-ups. Most people cannot do sit-up uh, due to lower back pain, tight back, or lack of mobility on, your, on, on the spine. And also sometimes uh, heavy weight and beginner also have uh, issues doing this. Uh, you can modify them by just do crunches instead. So crunches like so, just make sure you activate and squeeze your abdominal muscle to get the most benefit from, from the exercise. Don't pull your neck, yeah? Just uh, tap your hand lightly and don't pull them. Now I am showing you uh, V-ups. V-ups is one of the tough exercise to do. Um, also require lots of uh, strength and mobility okay so this is how you modify the v-up you can bend your knees and raise your upper body and your arm up and raise your body off the floor only halfway but make sure you activate or contracting your abdominal muscle to get uh, the most benefit of the exercise okay Another way to do the V-ups, you can do them alternative, alternate uh, leg and arm. So one leg, opposite arm. Do it like so, like example, lift yourself up off the floor halfway. Now I am showing you uh, side V-ups or oblique crunch. You can modify them by bending your knees forward and then one arm on the bottom, support yourself help put yourself up a little bit make sure you uh, activate your oblique muscle the side of your abs to get the most benefit okay and another version you can put one hand on your knee to support that and pull yourself up a little bit or put them down on the floor and push yourself up but make sure you activate your oblique okay Squeeze them and make them work, work that muscle. This one is sitting leg lift. How to modify them? You, uh, you put your feet down to the floor, bend your knee a little bit. If your leg straight, it's harder. But if you bend your knees, it's easier. So you just do one rep at a time, just like example. Uh, activate your core, squeeze them and pull your knee to your chest, okay? This one, Spider-Man planked or knee to elbow. Doing this exercise on the floor is quite challenging for beginner. Uh, put a lot of weight on your shoulder and on your lower back. So you find a chair or side of your bed or a bench, something you can raise yourself above ground. Now, uh, mountain climbers, uh, again, raise yourself off the floor by using a uh, chair or side of your bed and go slow not too fast so it will help reduce the challenge 